Hey everyone, I decided to just film a very chaotic video. Recently, we just gave away some furniture to some family friends. We just couldn't see us using it anytime soon in the near future. We, If we did, it would be for years and years and years. And we just decided to give it to someone who would get better use out of it. So that cleared up a lot of space in what we call our refurbished shed. We call it the cabin now. It literally used to be a shed where we stored things. Now, we still store things in the loft, but we put on insulation and walls and stuff like that, and that's where my library has been this whole time. However, it has been in that corner over there. And now that we have more space, I decided to move it to this corner over here. However, as you can see, this is a freaking disaster. I had to move all of my stuff over to that half of the shed of the cabin to get the furniture out and then I had to like move stuff around so that I could move the shelves and all of these things so I thought this could be like a library reorganization a shelf reorganization video really quick random chaotic if you're here for that stay tuned stay with me join me um by the way hey what's up my name is Elise if you're new here I'm glad that you decided to click on this video if you're not new welcome back love you guys um yeah so let's just get started basically what i'm doing so far i think i'm like totally gonna redo my shelves like completely so i'm thinking about doing series over here and maybe possibly even just authors that i have a lot of books of so i'm kind of like starting stacks of authors that I know that I have more than one of their books like right over here but I have so many books to go through still I still have those over here and then I have this whole stack over here and then there's some stacks on there for videos that I was preparing to film in the future so I don't know I might just put them back on the shelves and like maybe write them down instead that's kind of what we're doing right now <laughs> I'm already running out of room but I think I'm gonna order a TBR cart in the future so I can put the ones that I really want to focus on right there and then I have the rest on these shelves right here that's what's happening pure 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 chaos we're here for it <laughs> okay talk to you soon Inside my palms, play with me like cats and a string. You don't understand the pain it brings. You don't ever wanna give me wings. You don't ever wanna set me free. You know I'm addicted to you. Ain't it twisted? You've been gifted with the evil voodoo. Got me coming back for more, even when I've been screwed. Dolls full of pain. It's a little bit later. We've made some progress. So actually, earlier right here, there was this big kind of shelf. That had a bunch of stuff on it while well, I was able to take the stuff off and move it over here I think it's gonna look really nice in that corner here's a bunch of trash I need to get rid of in a little bit not my phone but the rest of it <laughs> I want to take this and put it somewhere else but for now I think that's gonna be a good location this is kind of like a hodgepodge of my stuff and my dad's stuff so this is some of my dad's decorations but for now I'm just gonna leave it there because it's his too I think although these are cute I think I might redo the curtains because this is just some old fabric I had once upon a time when we first put this up and we were gonna have guests like really quickly so I just like quickly quickly threw them together but I think I want something that's a little bit more opaque and has a little less sunlight I don't know so I might do that if I can find some spare fabric we're making progress and then the shelf is coming together ish <laughs> This part of the shelf is coming together. It's not organized by any author or anything. I'm considering doing that, so we'll just play around with it and see. I still need to I still need to tackle this. So I think what I'm going to do is I have a bunch of videos planned with these books. So I think I'm going to write them down in a list so that I can easily access that list and like know what I was planning on doing with them so I don't lose my ideas because if I don't write them down, I will forget. 
and then I'll move these over to this shelf. Like you in my bed, but you keep me on red. Oh, everything is like a test. I better not text or I'll come off desperate. But if I lay down and I play dead and I stay dead, maybe you'll get sick of being the monster out of my head, under my bed, thinking something out of my Until I need to go and do something, so let's see what I can get done in five minutes. <laughs> okay, five minutes is up. Not much progress. <laughs> I'm back. <laughs> Just had lunch with my family. I also have my boyfriend is here, and one of our good friends is here. So we're all kind of doing our own things today because we had four days off this weekend for Fourth of July. Yes, it's Fourth of July. <laughs> I wear this shirt both ironically and unironically. I just freaking love it so much. I love horses. <laughs> Isn't it great? I, that was such a tangent. Anyway, let's see if I can get some more done. I don't think you understand what you're doing. And my heart's black and blue from the bruising. I feel like when I'm with you, I'm losing. I feel like you think that this amusing. Sitting there gaslighting and confusing. Was it me? Is it me? Am I deluded? I'm the one who's always sorry, the conclusion Even though I offer all of the solutions I wish you loved me like I love you, it's stupid When I'm alone with you, I never feel lucid I wish I wasn't struck by Cupid I wish when I first saw you, I knew this When I'm with you, I feel so useless I feel diluted, my heart's been wounded Silhouettes of you are like a time Never really know just what you want with you, I don't ever feel calm. I can feel the sweat inside my palm. Okay. Oh no. Just realized. Dang it. I thought I was done with the series shelf, but I am not done with the series shelf. I'll show you what I have so far. There is literally no rhyme or reason. I think I'm gonna go back and rearrange it based on like what subgenre it is. So like if it's contemporary romance, sci-fi romance, fantasy, like Ruby Dixon from Blood and Ash, Gracelings, Hunger Games, Wings of Fire, blah, 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 all the way down here. But then I just realized that I have my first basket over here that needs to be over here. Shoot, gotta figure that one out. Okay, so I don't know if this is going to be a good idea. It's probably going to be a terrible idea. But I decided to try alphabetizing based on author on this side. We're going to see. It's always changeable, right? It's organized chaos, okay? We have A, B, C, kind of random D, F, G, H, I, J. Tons of M's. We have tons of S's and a decent stack of W's and R's. So... They're kind of in order, and then I'm gonna have to go and like kind of reorganize these based on last name as well. But it'll be nice because they're already kind of like all together. So. Play with me like that's industry. You don't understand the pain of brains. You don't ever wanna give me wings. You don't ever wanna set me free. But if I lay it down and I play it down. I hate it. I hate it. I don't mind this one. I like the series shelf. I think it looks really nice. Although I'm sure like the layout and the order of the books could go by genre a little bit more. But for the most part, I like this shelf. But this shelf, I hate it. And look, and then look at all the books that I couldn't fit in. Because I think before I, I had them stacked like this a lot more. And then I completely forgot my Christina Lore anyway. I'm gonna take a break. I need to film some videos. My friend is here this weekend and she also is a book lover. So she agreed to film a video with me and I need to do a few other things as well. So I'm just gonna take a break. I'll redo this later. Okay everyone, outfit change. It is the next day, but I finally finished, not on the top, 
but I did finish these shelves, so let me show you kind of what I did. So remember earlier, I was doing alphabetical order by author last name. I hated it so much, so I redid the whole thing. This shelf is the same. It's still all of the series, kind of not really in order of a genre or an author or anything. Just kind of put it where it fit, to be honest. But... This one we have some pretty covers that I really like. My special Omnibus edition of Air Awakens, the series that I love. Then we just kind of, kind of rainbow, but kind of not. But just whatever works. So we have the oranges and the salmons and the pinks going to the reds. Yellows going to a little bit of greens and light blues. Then we have the purples and the darker blues. Then we have the whites and creams and like my lone maroon and then all my black books, which I have so many black books. Then we have like the memoirs, the nonfiction, and my mass market paperbacks and some classics right there. And then we have these stacks that don't fit anywhere, but I am going to do a TBR card soon. So look forward to that. Also, over here, in my mess of everything over here, is a stack that I want to put on my TBR cart when I get it. So hopefully soon. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this very chaotic vlog of me, like, totally redoing my bookshelves randomly. This is still a mess. Like, this is still an absolute freaking disaster, but we'll get to it one day. Not today. <laughs> Bye, everyone. Thanks for watching. See you in my next video. Um.